Hello, welcome to Envision. I'm Deanne Conrad, Community Relations Supervisor, and we are here today with a test for Dr. Brian Maher, Superintendent. I didn't tell you that, did I? No, nor this is have be I a studied. Test. Oh, great. <laughs> You'll see what kind of ad libber he might be in the future and whether he can uh, carry the conversation or not. We're going to talk about the year end. Um, we're coming up on the close, and so the question I'd ask on this test is uh, what have you learned in the past year in terms of the Sioux Falls School District, and do you feel like this is different than your other superintendencies that you've had in the past. Hmm. Truly not prepared here. This isn't even a. <laughs> this isn't even a, a gimmick, a shtick going on here. Um, I, I think it. I think it's different. I think there are similarities and there are differences. And here's what I mean by that. I think there are similarities in that. You know, I, I came here expecting to be surrounded by really good quality people, mm -hmm. um, as I have been in, in past districts, and that certainly is the case. Here's one thing that's different about this district and the, the districts that I've served in in the past, and that is the size and the volume and the complexity that comes because of that volume um, that, uh, that has been new for me. Um, and, and that's where I really rely on the, the quality of the people that I, that I hang around. Because in many ways, many things have just continued to happen this year in spite of there being a new superintendent you know, in, in this seat. So. Uh, that, that's, uh, that's the quality um, vision that was in place before I ever sat in this seat. So, so that's, uh, that's very good. When I look back at the year, though, I think of, I think of really the, the programs as well as the people that are in place. And the, the, um, not only the typical, if you will, comprehensive high schools, comprehensive mm -hmm. middle schools, comprehensive elementaries that we have, but also our specialty areas. And they're every bit as good as advertised when I did my research in terms of being prepared to interview sure. for this position. You know, you look at the number of different elementary options you have that work their way through our middle schools and into our high schools. I look at our advanced placement programs. I look at New Tech High School. I look at CTE. Mm -hmm. And all of those specialty options that our students have or that the parents of our students have, um, I, I see greatness in the, in the school district. So, I think that's my very abbreviated version of what did I learn in this first year. One of the other things I learned that I suspected, but I've had confirmed, is that our community really values education. Mm -hmm. And that has been confirmed again and again and again. And that's a great place to be a Absolutely. public school superintendent in a, in a district that really values education. So I, I hope, hope that's a long-term thing. Yeah, those uh, partnerships that we have in our community where um, organizations, whether nonprofit or business community, stepping up to say, hey, you know, we can help with this resource or that resource or, or just having that conversation back and forth. We've done some wonderful things other great things to, to come in terms of those partnerships. Right, you know, and uh, from those partnerships, from those conversations, um, people weren't, a, weren't afraid to talk about some gaps that exist. Mm -hmm. And when you're in a place of excellence, which I really believe we are, and I think we've got a lot of evidence that suggests that we are as a school district, um, it's easy to turn a blind eye to some gaps that might exist. Then I think through the strategic planning process, through the data assessment uh, analysis, et cetera, We've we've uh, identified some of those gaps, so hopefully we can maintain that maintain that level of excellence, and continue to fill in some of those gaps that exist. So, okay. that's uh, that's in a nutshell what I've learned through one year. I say you passed. Ah, I would give awesome. you an A. That's great. To you know, know what? An A plus. How about you that? You need to talk to our school board. <laughs> <laughs> they are the ones that yeah, judge yeah. whether or not uh, he gets an A. It's, so, it's been a great year. Oh, well, wonderful. It's been wonderful having you, and uh, thank you for joining, joining us on Envision.